and uh, played with him in college. Uh, I've known Lonnie. Uh, I've known uh, D. Walk. I've known a, a number of guys in here, and uh, you know that mentality. Ben has had that same mentality since college. Uh, that get it done no matter what. Uh, I'm going to be dependable attitude, and I know the standard that he carries himself with. Uh, so if I can emulate that on the outside, I know I'll be all right. How does that process work as far as like speed dating, getting acclimated with your quarterback, and developing that quick relationship? Uh, I mean, it, it's. Uh, Sometimes it's, it's not pretty, but you have to do uh, the work that's necessary. You know, I have to gain the trust of not only my quarterback, but everybody else on that field in order to be out there. Successful teams trust each other. Uh, and uh, on a short week, you got to build that trust uh, quickly. But uh, that's part of the reason why uh, you take the extra time in the classroom and you make sure that when you go out there on that field, you're right. Um, you know, I can say that from my perspective, I've always thought the Titans were a physical team. I thought that they were a team that didn't let you dictate what they were going to do. They're not going to let the defense dictate how they run the ball. They're not going to let the, the defense dictate how they throw the ball. They uh, have a solid identity of who they are, and they're going to execute that better than you execute yours. Do you recognize there is an opportunity for you to step up and, and help this team in a certain situation if they need it? I'm um, just trying to take it day by day, you know, try to keep improving and, like I say, studying and doing whatever I need to do in order to prepare myself. I mean, plenty, but not uh, many I want to go into detail, you know, but just taking the coaching and going and working at it, that's all. How about the comfort level with the offense? I'm sure that's something that's I'm just trying to take it day by day, you know. You probably got to ask this already, so I apologize. But just, you know, you're always prepared to be the starter each week. But do your antennas go up a little bit more this week with Ryan being a little bit hollow? I mean, not truly. I mean, that's where the routine comes at hand. I mean, you should be preparing, preparing like you might get in the game any any other week, you know. Uh, and you hate to see Ryan, you know, go down and have to come back. But uh, like I say, we just take it day by day and try to keep yourself prepared. How different is this from what you were used to in college? How different is this first month or so been when it was having to wait, not knowing if you were going to get to be needed out there? Tomorrow? I mean, it's like any other, you know, it's like college, it's like high school. It's when you're not the guy, it's just being prepared to be the guy whenever your number is called. I mean, it's just about staying in, you know, your routine and progressing each week and having yourself prepared to go out there and execute if you called upon. You're a pretty confident guy. I mean, you're confident in what you can do. Hey, I'm blessed. I'm just go out there and have fun and see where the chips fall. It was like 90 or 79. 79. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, basically, you know, it's all for the game, all four quarter game. You know, um, just you know, bring it. I think you know, these uh, weeks um, before, you know, second half, we've had to kind of some some struggles. You know, all three phases. But just to come in this game, just try to play a full complete game. You know, all three phases. That's specifically when we're talking numbers. So they haven't been good in the fourth quarter. You guys have scored a total of three points in the fourth quarter. Yeah. I mean, is, is, do you have a feeling it's going to come down to that? Um, I feel like, you know, if we prepare the way we're supposed to prepare this week, you know, I think, you know, uh, you know it's going to be hard to beat. Um, I think we have the, the players here, you know, the, the coaches here, you know, make things happen. So coming to the practice, you know, preparing the right way, you know, we'll be all right. A guy like Mills, obviously, he doesn't have great numbers, but, you know, he's a tough, he's a tough mobile guy. I mean, he'll hang in there and, and try to make plays, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, I think I, I played him uh, last year. Uh, he's tough, you know, young kid. Like, okay, I don't know how old he is, honestly, but um, he, he's been in there since I've been here a couple of times, you know, so, you know, we'll be ready for, you know, uh, any new looks or whatever, but, you know, he's, I, I like him as a quarterback. And I guess the running back is like leads, leads the league in like missed tackles. Yeah. And, um, seems like a physical guy, kind of uh, kind of guy you like to go up against. What yeah. have you seen from him on? Um, I, I said earlier, I, I like him. I like his game. He runs hard. Um, but I think we, we play, you know, some good backs already. Um, so I think. As far as the run game, you know, we'll be prepared, you know, uh, watch the film, you know, coming to the game ready.